So it's no surprise a ton of people have been moving to Florida, but a few of the reasons why people are moving may surprise you. I thought I'd quickly cover a few of those key reasons why so many people are moving to Florida. Obviously, we're called the Sunshine State for a reason, and that's because we average over 250 days a year of sunshine. But let's be honest, the hot, humid, mosquito state just doesn't have the same ring to it. But if we're gonna tell the truth here, that's more of a real life description of what Florida can be. We definitely have some beautiful sunny days here, but it does get pretty hot. You can expect temperatures in the upper 90s, close to 100 degrees, and then along with the humidity, that can really cause some uncomfortableness. Now here in Gainesville, our winters obviously don't get as cold as up north, but we will get a couple of hard freezes every year. But overall, the climate is pretty consistent. Now because of that consistent weather, if you love outdoor sports like paddleboarding, kayaking, fishing, hiking, running, swimming, or boating, then definitely look no further than Florida. Of course, along with the weather, one other thing that you'll wanna keep in mind are the storms and the hurricanes that Florida does get. Now, of course, storms and hurricanes are gonna be location specific, so if you're anywhere along the coastline, that's gonna be more of a significant issue. But luckily for a place like Gainesville, where I live, we're far enough in the middle of the state and kind of on the northern side, so the major storms typically slow down and are pretty weak by the time they get to us. Now, of course, one of the major reasons so many people move to Florida is because Florida does not have an income tax. So Florida is one of the few states that does not have an income tax, and that lets you keep a little bit more money in your pocket. Rather, Florida earns the majority of its money through the millions and millions spent on tourism. So even if you don't live here, you're probably gonna at least wanna visit. Now, don't get me wrong, when you are a local, all of those tourists can seem like a nuisance, but you do have to keep in mind they pay for a lot of bills here in Florida. Now you know why one of the reasons Florida vacations are so expensive. One thing to keep in mind is that being a Florida resident has its benefit when you visit the theme parks because you will receive that offer at a discounted rate. Move.org actually recently reported that Florida was the number one destination for Americans relocating, especially from states like California, New York, and Texas. Beyond just vacations, our top rated beaches are another reason why so many people are choosing to move to Florida. There are so many different options when it comes to beaches, from the Panhandle and the Gulf to the East Coast near Daytona and St. Augustine, all the way down to Miami and the Keys. Florida beaches are ranked some of the most amazing in the United States. If you don't already live in Florida or already want to live in Florida, chances are you've probably vacationed here because let's face it, it's beautiful. In addition to our great beaches, another reason so many people are moving to Florida is because there's so much to do year round here. Florida has nearly 200 state parks to explore, from horseback riding on the beaches, kayaking in the lakes, or inner tubing down the rivers. You can also hike through all of these great parks. There's plenty to explore and stay active here in our state. Of course, Florida is really well known for all of its theme parks. You've got Disney World, SeaWorld, Busch Gardens, and Universal Studios, just to name a few. And actually eight of the top 20 theme parks in the entire country are located in Florida, and three of the top 20 water parks in the entire world are also here in Florida. In addition to all the theme parks, you've also got unique attractions like Kennedy Space Center and amazing museums throughout the state. Now the other great thing about Florida is that you don't have to live in Orlando or directly on the beaches to really enjoy the state. You can live in a place like Gainesville. Here we're only about two hours from the beach and all the theme parks, so it's really centralized. It makes it really easy for day trips to get out on the weekend, do something a little bit different, but still be back home that same night or within a few hours. Another reason so many people are moving to Florida is because it's got such a strong economy and job market here. One major industry seeing growth in Florida is the healthcare industry, which has grown significantly in Florida in the past few decades alone. And actually, Florida ranks among the top 10 highest paying states for physicians. A few of the top hospitals here in the state to keep an eye on would be places like the Mayo Clinic in Jacksonville, Advent Health in Orlando, you've also got UF Health Shands Hospital in Gainesville, and then the Tampa General Hospital. When it comes to healthcare, for example, here in Gainesville, we've got UF Health Shands Hospital in town, which is an amazing facility with a lot of specialty world-class doctors. You've also got North Florida Regional Medical Center and the VA Hospital all in one relatively small town. So on a personal note, having great medical facilities here in Gainesville had made a huge impact in our lives. Our son Carter was actually born prematurely and had to spend some time in the NICU. And the fact that we didn't have to drive hours away or mid-delivery be transferred to a different hospital made a huge difference. 
Now, when it comes to a strong economy and a growing job market, the National Association of Realtors also indicated that Florida in 2021 had the largest commercial market growth, which means more people are coming here to open business and set down roots. Now, between the climate, healthcare, and taxes, it's easy to see why so many people are relocating to Florida, but it's honestly an even better place to retire. Though so many think of Florida as only a place for beach vacations and spring breakers to visit, more and more people People are actually moving to Florida to retire and spend their golden years. The weather here, the views, and specifically some of the communities here really just don't compare to anywhere else. There's so many different options in Florida. Whether you're looking to stay extremely active and want easy lifestyle in a condo living atmosphere, or you want to just play golf every day and drive your golf cart around the entire community, there's so many different places from Miami to the villages to check out. Now with so many people choosing to relocate to Florida, that's obviously had a significant impact on the real estate and housing market here. One challenge Florida is having is this huge increase in demand, but the supply level is just not meeting it and the home builders really can't build homes fast enough. And that disparity between supply and demand is one of the reasons why we've seen an increase in home prices. But even with that said, Florida still consistently comes up less expensive than other states like California and New York. Now, real quick, down in the comments, let me know if you weren't planning to move to Florida, what other state would you be interested in? Now, one of the last major reasons why so many people are moving here to Florida is because of the cost of living. If you're curious if you can actually afford to live here, what you'll want to do next is go ahead and watch this video where I share with you the true cost of living here in Florida.